this is Dick Harris YouTube channel and welcome to another I fuck around video. <laughs> hey guys, it's Dick here here again today and today marks one year of Dick Hero. Oh, today actually isn't officially the day that I'm filming this, but when you watch this, it will be. Hi, I'm Kira from the past, and it's good to hear too. Today, I'm going to be doing a very special Q and A. Ask Kira eight. I have all the questions on my iPod, so let's just get stuck into it. I just pick a random one, close my eyes, and click on it. That one. If you could listen to only, if you could only listen to one album for the rest of your life, what album would it be, and why? Um, album I would listen to for the rest of my life. The one album is Love Drunk by Boys Like Girls. I would listen to that until the day I die. I don't care. That is the one album I would listen to for the rest of my life. Just If you haven't downloaded it already, you should probably go and download it from iTunes. I'm sure it's only like $7.99 or something when the average album is $9.99. It's just heaven. What would you like to change about society? People blame society for a lot of things in going wrong with the world and the fact is we are society so we should be really blaming ourselves but I think the generation that we live in I think what I would change about the generation we live in is how people talk to each other for starters like people don't even talk to their parents with a little bit of respect nowadays how can you expect it from anyone else like I just that's all I want to say to be honest. live in a perfectly good environment why are you talking like you live in a bin next one is you do you think I'm weird? This is one from Sarah, she hasn't put this on my mind list, but Sarah, you are freaking the weirdest person I know, but I wouldn't change you for the world. Do you like Carrie Hope Fletcher? I love Carrie Hope Fletcher, but I like her brother more. Good day. Thank you for asking this question. I don't think any person that does Q&As on YouTube really gets the question, Do you, did you have a good day? But yes, I did have a very wonderful day. Thank you very much. Opinion on The Fault in Our Stars. Uh, my opinion on The Fault in Our Stars is I, the book is much better than the movie. I'm, I must say they did a great job, but if you want to go see my The Fault in Our Stars um, review, you can click in this little thing here. You can, I'll put it in a connotation here. That's right, Shakira. You're editing right now. I, you can see all my review on the Fortnite Stars in the link here. Favourite movie? Okay, my, one of my favourite movies, not my all time favourite because I don't have one, but one of my favourites is The Bridge to Terabithia. If you have not watched it, you will have not lived, you have not cried, you have not laughed. It is one of the greatest movies I have ever seen. And it has really features young Josh Hutchison in it, which is Peter from The Hunger Games. You can't go wrong. Favourite colour? My favourite colour is red, but I'm loving this turquoise hat. Or oh, turquoise blue hat. I love the tulip. The color, the color turquoise in all of its glory. I also love the color black, which is why my nails are mostly black because it makes my skin look really tanned. What animal would you be now and why? I'm considering this to be related to my last video, my last video, which was the uh, the selfie tag, which my last video. But I think I would be now. I would be a um, a cat because I just don't care about anything. I'm just laid back and I don't know. I just I'm laid back. I love to sleep, even though I can't really sometimes. Um, I love to just drink milk and just be a cat, you know, just sit on the butt and twizzle my tail around. Because why not? Everyone has tails. Bad habits! I have four bad habits. Two of them are physical and two of them are mental issues. But the physical ones are I have a habit of sucking my thumb. Taking too long to answer questions? That's kind of a physical thing talk way too fast when I'm talking to people about my YouTube channel I say YouTube I go my YouTube channel what YouTube channel what YouTube channel I just spat on my camera um interrupting people that is one of them I hate when I interrupt people I'm just like oh I'm so sorry like if they were talking about something that triggers something in my mind and I'll go, oh yeah, because I'll just forget it. And if I interrupt you, I'm so sorry, but I don't mean to do it. I am annoyed at myself, but I have an idea of what I need to tell you. And then I interrupt you because I'll forget. And that it isn't out of like hatred, like, oh, stop talking. It's out of my simple mind will just forget it. <sighs> Penis. Favorite Ariana Grande song. Don't get me wrong, I do like Ariana Grande's music, but not the actual person. I wouldn't really class her as an idol because she doesn't really do anything for me. But I suppose if it depends which way you look at her. Um, 
look at that. Sorry, if you you won't get that if you don't know that. I, I guess it depends which way you see her, to be honest. If you're not in the Janoski Unit fandom, you probably love the bitch, but I don't. Sorry, I called her a bitch. You shouldn't have probably done that. But at the moment, I do have a favourite song of hers. Um, My favourite song of hers, well, I have two on her new album, My Everything, I think it's called. Um, One of them is Try Hard. Why Try? Oh, that's a five second song fun. Fun song. Um, why try and break your heart right back because I love those songs so much I can relate to them so badly I'm up in here singing break your heart right back at 8am and 8am. I'm just like whoa Bob click I love them two songs and I'm not slating her. I'm not bashing her I'm just saying my opinion because you know this is a Q&A if you don't want opinions you can click right off my screen Now Now do it. Ow. I just pointed myself just click off now if you don't like opinions because that's what I'm all about. Like I'm just leaking opinions. Like they're going all over you, it's acid. One thing that annoys you about society. Again, I'm gonna change the question to one thing that annoys you about our generation because we are our society. What annoys me the most about society is um, that we can we understand stuff like um, bay, slay, um, all those kind of words like G. That's a word, that's a thing by the way. People who are using those words don't actually know the difference between two two and two in the English language, but they can just make up their own, own language. <sighs> Learn English before you start making your own language. Favourite Muckfly and Busted song? This is a hard one. Uh, five colours in her hair, because that song just damn, damn. These girls in my class go, oh damn, so that song just deserves one of those. <laughs> my favourite Busted song? Everything I love, but I love busted more than I love McFly. What I go to school for because the lyrics are just nonsense, and I love it. Either what I go to school for, or Air Hostess because that is my ultimate jam. Or Year Three Thousand, or Over Now, or, or anything by Busted. Basically, I'm clenching my butt right now. I don't... <laughs> Favorite original Disney show. This is hard. But I really loved That's a Raven because I thought it was really funny and I just was loved it because the concept of it, like a girl seeing the future was, visions was amazing to me, I just loved it. My second favourite would probably be, I know you didn't ask this, but Sweet Life of Zack and Cody on deck, on everything, on just on slay. Two words. Sprouse nudes. Recreate your favourite emoji. This is the best non-question I have ever gotten last year. Bow down to you. <laughs> Bow down to you, whoever sent that question. Whatever. <laughs> what is the most important thing to know before starting a YouTube channel? The most important thing to know would probably to be never give up because if you're serious about this and you are serious about carrying on with the YouTube channel, then you need to know that you can't just give up within the first five seconds. You haven't got 100 subscribers in the first five minutes you're not going to give up because that is how you could lose stuff. You need to chase your dreams as, as much as you were chasing that boy in the playground a minute ago. Oh boy, you know boys. As much as you were chasing that girl, you need to chase your dreams like that because you ain't getting anywhere if you just give up. Before you even think or attempt to think of a username or think of thinking and think of thinking of thinking of making a username, you need to know that as soon as you give up, you're gonna have to start again because you ain't gonna get anywhere if you just give up in the first five minutes because you haven't got a million subscribers or 30 million like PewDiePie. <sighs> Everyone has to start somewhere. That's the one thing you need to know. Starting from the bottom, now we're here. Ugh, I just spat everywhere. What is your relationship, Kira? You're so goddamn confusing. Sometimes I just end up confused. Trust me, you are as confused right now as I am. Um, I got out of a relationship almost. Three weeks ago? I was thinking it's time to move on because what's the point of just sitting around and going, ah, why not? Why not just get up and go to a strip club? <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm 14, nearly 15, but I'm still not little love to go to a strip club. I'm single and I probably stood that way for a long time. <laughs> um, but I do wish the best of luck to my ex boyfriend and his new girlfriend, so. What is your favourite Demi Lovato song? Everything! How can you pick one? Oh, I love Gift of a Friend, I love. Well, the, actually, my favourite would probably be Remember December because it was the first one that I heard and my birthday's in December, so I kind of thought that the song was made for me when I first heard it. I was like, this is my song. You know how the white girls get up to like turn down for what? My Remember December was my jam. What is the best news you've ever received? The best um, news I received was when I was eight and I was being told that my baby brother was being born and when I was 10 and had 
been told that my baby sister was being born. They're my two best. Nobody can compare to that. I don't care if I get a million subscribers, three million. I don't care if Obama just comes down the street. My brother and sister are literally my world. And even though I don't see them every day, they don't live near me. They don't even live in the vicinity. They live four hours away. I don't really see them that often, like once a year. What colored toothbrush do you have? I have a red toothbrush. I will go and get it. Ah, my toothbrush. Mwah. I guess just I just kissed you. Would you ever consider it's a little bit of? There's the burp of the day. Shaniqua is walking outside with her hoop earrings. Look that girl. Oh, she just dissed off a granny. There's gonna be a throwdown. She gotta get that tree to hold her earrings because I ain't doing it that messy. There's someone getting a delivery. Where's mine? Where is mine? Excuse me, I want some. 